Oh, we got comic book Cracko for the last yeah, level. That's pretty did. fucking got rad. Got a sticker. Here on the D-pad, I'm Rick. Straw. Oh, and I'm Jeff, and I was about to stand up real quick. Oh, well, fine. <laughs> Do it. <laughs> Take that episode in your face. Wow, what a rude man. <laughs> Standing over there with his legs. Wow, with your legs. <laughs> oh, my God. Several days later. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, my God. Yeah, this is uh, Kirby Planet Robobot. We're here in Meta Nightmare Returns. And just before we started this, I had a mild crisis where I was like, uh-oh. When we did Kirby's uh, Kirby Nightmare in Dreamland, I believe we did a separate numbering scheme when we did the Meta Nightmare in that game. But... There was another game we did that had a Meta Nightmare mode. It might have been Triple Deluxe, where I don't think we changed the numbering. Like, I'm going to have to go back and look, because this isn't the last thing we're going to be doing here. There is one more thing we're going to look at before we're, like, done with Planet Robobot, and looking at it now, it's like, maybe we should have done that before this, but whatever. I think it'll be oh, fine. You made these choices. I did. I did make these choices. Now. I have to be responsible for my choices here. Um, I do not at all remember the names of these worlds we're in. It's been five years since we played this game, so... This is some ocean world. Oh, yeah. And it's like, maybe it's Blue Ocean or something. Like, they've done colors before. They've done foods before. Blocky! It's Blocky! So this guy was a mini-boss from Kirby's Dream Land 2 also. There we go. He used to give you the uh, stone power back in the day. I think he still does now. I would have I to mean, imagine. Yeah, right. All right. Oh no, Damn, those little froggies! Up your shits. They didn't do nothing to you. Fucking up their shit. How could shit. you do that to them? They were so nice. They were so sweet. All they wanted was something to eat. And you told them eat. Pretty much, I tell most things eat. Am I doing? Am I doing slang correctly? No. Please validate my slang. No. I'm getting old. My bones hurt. I'll make your bones hurt. Yeet yeet. Can you Now yeet? I'm really gonna make your bones hurt, baby. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. Alright. Poggers. Pog face. Can you not? I could not. I probably okay. will not. All right. I don't like the lips on those on these guys. Something about that. Oh, it's part of their head. Their head. That's gear. part of the helmet. Yeah. I thought that was like actual like fleshy lips. I'm like, I something. You need some chapstick, man. <laughs> that looks rough. <laughs> or like you're just making the <laughs> face so hard that like the skin of your lips is being pulled back like an overstretched balloon. Also not good to do. No. Yeah. No. Definitely not good. You could, like, really mess up your lips doing that too hard. It's weird to think about, like, in its own way that, like, maybe it's just because it's a different color or whatever, but, like, the skin on your face and the skin on your lips and inside your mouth are all functionally just the same shit. No, because inside your mouth it's a mucous membrane. I guess that's it's true. It's more different. of a mucous membrane once it gets inside the edge of your lip. I guess that's true. You're not yeah, allowed to do true. any doctor stuff. I don't plan to be a doctor. <laughs> I don't know. My brain always just thinks of it as like, oh yeah, skin and skin. No, but it's still very different. No, it is, no, you're you're totally right. <laughs> it's definitely true. There we go. Maybe it's just because like lips are less. I mean, mucus e. I mean, sure, lips might not be technically a mucous membrane. I'm not sure about that. I mean, it's like Did some I weird, like, oh, it is auto-scrolling. I didn't realize that. Yeah, it's been auto-scrolling. It I'm is cute sure. that when you go into the foreground, it goes one way and the background goes the other, though. That's I don't fun. think I wanted to bother with no, that. No, I think it was a section for, like, Kirby to get a treasure. It's hard to say sometimes. You're like, oh, it's cool, a, a button star. You're right. And you're like, oh, this will be fun. I think the orange ones are ones you want to avoid because those usually are ones you come back from. Yeah, one way. Yeah. yeah versus well, no, not. orange ones are. This are is one way versus not one way. Yeah. Oh, another one of these. Star, no star, star. This is trying to help. All right. The only mm. downside with this is I'm set at how fast I yeah. can get through it. It is a bummer for like a speed runny sort of moment here. Can you just go past it? 
Oh yeah, fuck it. Like I should take the star if I want to get the treasure, but yeah. I don't give a fuck. Right. So I think this is gonna be the empty one, yeah, to signify that you went the wrong way. Gotcha. I forgot that there were like fake treasure chests. Right. Oh, it's three it's gonna be like three separate zones. Oh, you definitely yeah, you're gonna to. need to. Alright. Okie dokie. Okay, gonna be a lot of flipping back and forth. Yep. Kind of slightly slowly. Satellite laser man! With the frog, frog. spitting goop. Alrighty. Yeah, I guess the fast right. Oh, oh fucking punch bot. A little, a little uh, green dude reminded me of uh, a Pokemon called um, Fomantis, I think. I think it was Fomantis. And it no, evolves into a Pokemon named Lurantis. Only press one big button. Okay, it's fine. Praying Mantis Pokemon. Oh, this is a minor, minor key version of um. Uh oh my God! What the hell is the name of it? It's the uh, Float Islands from Kirby's Dream Land. The name is your boat. Oh right, that visual in the background that was super gross to us the first time around too. It's something about watching something ice cream glurp like it that. out like that is like really not it's a little okay. With the with the swiveling, it's yeah, little, it's a little poopish. It's just a it's little weird for me to say. It's a little poopish. Oh, what? Um, an error has occurred. Uh, Hold down the power. Hang on one button second, to turn guys. Off the power. Okay, so uh, we're back. I guess that was odd. I guess we managed to crash the game. That was very weird, uh, but I guess let's go back into Meta Nightmare Returns. We should be able to just continue. Hopefully. I think we were just shy of a save point. Yeah, so we're going to have to just start level, level three, three over, which is a bummer because I feel like we were like almost up to a save point. <sighs> yeah, because that's the one that the start of the thing, but all right. We'll give it another go. We lost seven minutes. That's okay. We will make do. We even got our little... Our little Lone, lone Meta Knight theme again. I do like this theme. It's a really good one. I kind of almost wish it played the whole time. Right? It doesn't. The, and it's funny because like they they don't really They've remix it much. They've done that sometimes. Well, they like just don't. They don't really remix it much. They pretty much are like they always play it straight. I think because people just know that it's a good theme. So it's like, well, if it ain't broke, right? If it don't ain't fix broke, it. don't fix it. Yeah. Oh no, we're back to the creepy smoochy fish. It always cracks me up when they have them wearing, like, goggles or something to be underwater. Yeah. And I'm like, they're fish. Even the most basic ones, whose names I can never remember. Yeah, the goggle fish. The ones that are basically, yeah, the goggle fish. Uh, they, they remind me of Cheap Cheeps from Mario. I do not remember the names of them Yeah, here. they're very similar to Cheap Cheeps from Mario. It's funny. Pistons fans, it's blocky. Yeah. Uh, did you start with zero points, do you know? Yeah, it did, which is a little unfortunate. But they don't make them particularly hard to get. That's true, yeah. They they come back pretty quickly. Almost there. Uh, this should do it. Oh, he's in the background. That's why. Damn oh, it. rude. There you go. That's annoying. Ba-boom. Let me get some healing Take in there. Take that heal. Yeah. Oh, I'd reset your extra lives, too. Yeah, it reset all my count. That sucks. Which was just a little frustrating. Come on, game. Because it's fun to count up to see how well you've been doing. Right? And it's also sort of like, okay, then what was the point of having save points if you don't actually give a shit yeah, what right, I like, got at that moment in time? I think it's just for the sake of being like, yeah, if you, if you saved here, then if you turn it off, you can start from the midpoint of the world, I guess. So my guess is what happens is they do the first half of the world stages, then they do the extra stage, then they have the save point, then they do the second half of the world stages, and then the boss. That seems to be how they're doing this. All right. Nice. Yay. Gun. All right, we're back on track. And not smoking crack. Kirby would never smoke crack. How dare you insinuate that? People of the um. internet, how dare you? How double dog dare you? Jeff, you missed it. We crashed the game. Vigorously. Wait, for real? Yeah, literally the game very how? abruptly was like, uh, the game broke. And I'm like, whoa. You got it's like an a error power message off. and everything? Yeah, it said to power off the game and try again. Oh, we're like, geez. whoa. 
No idea what triggered it. It was like you got you you hit the ice cream cone in a weird way, I guess. The ice cream cone hit me. That's true. <laughs> they fall. Maybe he was just afraid of being e- of being eaten. Big poopy ice cream. <laughs> Maybe it didn't like being referred to as poop. Big poopy ice cream. It was yeah. very poopish. When you see it, you'll understand what I mean. It's yep. a pretty poopish. It's a big like tube that delivers soft serve ice cream in a swirl. Yeah. It like go bloopity bloops it around there. It kind of sounds like a butt. It's kind of buttish. It's kind of what a butt is. It's buttish delivering poopish. Oh, thank God, we're out of the water level. Oh my God, that was fast. Um, so you're redoing this level. This is I the have level to. You were about seven on? minutes in. Yeah. Okay, that stinks. I, yeah. It's, yes. <laughs> it's true. This will actually probably be two episodes. Not really a witty or pithy comment there, but yeah, that stinks. Yeah, uh, bummer. Yeah, this will probably be. Uh, Two levels, and like we'll have to see how, or two episodes, and we'll have to see how the later ones go. Like later worlds might be two episodes, also. Mm. I'm not really sure. Well, the times have definitely depends on my mad skills. They've a drifted bit. up a little bit, but it was like so. The game pauses when you're transitioning, like right now. Oh, okay. But so there's probably another minute or so for each level. Yeah. I'm actually not entirely sure what I'm gonna do with the bottom screen for this. I think I'm gonna leave everything off except for. Part of me is like, do I keep the timer there? It's like, it's just kind of in the way. Like, it's not that important to it's, see the timer as we're going. When the bottom is basically just a control panel. Yeah. Because, like, our health is on the screen. Yeah. It's not really the health any- is the most important thing on there. And, like, knowing how many Meta Knight points Sarah has is not that important here. Yeah, and the and the M tokens are Especially not. Especially when I basically almost always have 50. Yeah. yeah. So... Because I think uh, when we did this before, we kept like the status bar, like the the very top of the bottom screen was visible, and I faded it out if if uh, we needed to interact in that area, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. which is fine. It's a little bit of it's a little bit of extra work, but like I just don't know if like the life total, the M counter total, and the time are important enough. Not really essential. Like I would actually almost prefer to have the meta the the meta knight point counter thing on screen than anything else, but it just takes up so much of the bottom screen. Yeah, for one number. Yeah, that it's kind of unreasonable. So we might just go no bottom screen for most of this. I think that'd be the better way to approach it. Yeah, I think it'll be fine. All right, we gotta see if we can get uh, past the ice cream so poops. Many flips. Oh god. So many the ice cream pooper. This section. <laughs> Some people have an ice cream scoop. We got an ice cream poop. Would you like a poop of ice cream? Yep. Does this Did does you this make order this officially you poop of ice cream for later, baby? <laughs> I, I have not yet, but I was considering it. Do we uh d- would this technically make this episode a YouTube poop? <laughs> Especially since the uh, the 3DS pooped out on us. Are you gonna order from poop and poodery? I might I might order from poop and poodery. It really does work, doesn't it? Yeah. Oh boy. Oh, there you <laughs> Classic. go. Classic. Classic ice cream restaurant poop it, and poodery. It actually works better than scoop and scootery. Yeah. That's unfortunate. Because, again, the very first time and every time since then we ordered from them, I tried to see if there are any scooters on the menu. Yeah, none. Not one. Oh, yeah, here's our pooper. Ugh. You, yeah, right? Like, it kind of... Uh, Just slightly yeah, unsettling. It, the rotational right? creation of the ice cream is very weird. Like, it's being formed. Yeah. And this is <gasps> what? No. Oh, this is what happened last time. Whoa! Okay, this is a little worrisome. Why don't we come back next time? Uh, that's not good. Uh, uh-uh, nope. Bye. Bye.